So once you're logged on to QuickBooks Online, we're going to go to Reports, Profit and Loss, and our standard profit and loss is going to uh, show up. Now, what we want to do is see it by location. So let's go to Customize, Filter, and here we have Location. I only want to see the transactions for Chicago. So I'm going to select Chicago and hit Run Report. Now, I only have two transactions in this example, one in income and one as an expense. But you, as you keep adding transactions and adding a location to your transactions, this will be you know, more full of activity. So I'm going to click on the 9500. So I want to see the invoice. So I'm going to open it up. And here we can see we have the location of Chicago. Go ahead and close. Back to summary report. And now I want to see this 1900. And it looks like we paid Jane Smith commission. 1900 for that cool cars uh, invoice. Here we have the class selected commission Jane Smith on this date. Wonderful. Save. Close. So in short, that is how you generate a profit and loss by location.